Activity nine, which can be a follow-on from activity seven, uh, eight. Um, same area. Um, you'll notice there we again make everything competitive so that people have a means of scoring a goal. With defenders in smaller numbers, I always think it's important that they're the ones that can score because it keeps them motivated and interested. So we'll get started on activity nine. Four versus four, plus four on the outside. Okay, guys, Reds, I'd like one of you outside on each side of the area, please. So three of you going that way, one's over there. Outside. Can we just quickly track those balls down and get them back in around the edge of the square? Excellent work. Track those in, get them back close to you. Simple activity now. We have in the middle here, orange is playing blue. Four against four. But if blues are in possession, they've also got the opportunity to pass to the four reds. If oranges are in possession, they can pass to the four reds. Can you play that ball to me, please? Play on. Hey, my Stop there. Blues change with reds. Play on. Ball goes out, leave it to the people on the outside. Orange ball, let's go. Let's go. Changing blues, play on blues, play on, you've got the ball at your feet. That's out, red ball. Let's go. Excellent work, keep it moving. Red ball, red ball. Just closest ball, there's one there, right next to you. Off we go, well done. Don't go chasing balls. Well done. Could have played it first time, Michael. Bad luck. Much better attitude as well. Good job. Bad luck. And stop there, Reds outside again. Listening to me. Ball to me, please. I've got one, good job. Okay, Blues versus Oranges in the middle now, but you can now score a goal. This is how we score. If I'm blue and I give it to a Red on the outside, and you can play it with one touch to another Blue, so blue to blue, one nil, we've scored. Ball to me, please. If I pass it and you play it back to me, well played, we've kept the ball, but we haven't scored. Okay, so the only way to score is to pass it to the outside player 
and one of your teammates gets it. Blue ball. Yep. Hey, Ovi. Ovi! One nil. Michael. Yep. Yep. Two nil. Don't worry about defending, Oranges. Yep. Oh. No, you don't have to. It's not easy yeah, to yeah. play one touch. Three. Don't. Go. Is that one all? Two one. Yes, one all. Get it to an end person. Can you get it back? Bad luck, two touches. Got to be one to score. Yeah. It's a goal. It's a goal. Yeah, right. Did he defend better than that, Orange Red right. Blues? It's another goal. Can you score again? Bad luck, bad luck. And Blue swap with Reds. Blue swap with Reds. Play on, Oranges. Play on. Two touches, so it's too late. Oh, bad luck. Play off the end, man, you get a goal. Nice and simple, is that? Water. Orange ball. Get in from the side, as quickly as you can. Yes. Two touches, no goal. Stop there, guys. Well played. Well done. So, another great activity involving every aspect of the game. Uh, four versus four in the middle. Originally possession. The four on the outside play for both teams. Okay, so they're always um, always uh, available. Introduce goal scoring. If you play a one-two with a person on the outside who only has one touch, and it goes to a third party, that's a goal. So really good competitive game. You'll find that as players play this, they really develop very, very quickly. And once they've done it two or three times, it becomes very competitive, high quality football, and it's a really good activity for the game.